right, so here's what we're doing. Um, this is going to be kind of our first uh, Mile High Endurance podcast video where we're actually going to be covering some products here. So if you've been listening to the show, uh, you're still listening, which is great. If you are just watching the video for the first time, welcome. Uh, here we go. I've got Bill and Kim on the phone, of course. And here's what we're going to talk about. Sh- We've just been talking about i Labs. We had Mark Fleming as the guest. And what I want to show you is what the product actually looks like. It's this glass bottle, small glass bottle, uh, with, what is it, 300 mil grams of hemp extract. You can see it right there. Uh, the pump has got a little guard on it, which I'll pop off. That's just to make sure that you don't accidentally waste any of the product. And then it's just a pump that you spray just one pump under the tongue and that's it. That's what it looks like. And uh, it's great stuff. So there you go. There's i that's a pretty straightforward little um, showing of a product. The other one that I want to show you, and we've been talking about it on the show, are rip laces. And I've got a couple of things to show you. This is just a packet of the uh, cores. So what I'm holding up, Kim, is what I sent you, that mm-hmm. um, that uh, Ziploc bag with the, uh, <laughs> the cores in it. And I'm going to open these up so you can kind of see what they look like. I like the I like the uh, audio sound of that. Uh, this is like really uh, really interactive here. There's actually a couple of different different cores in here that we have in the sample set that David from Riplace has sent us. They have the this particular one has the black cores with the Riplace's um, raised lettering on it. So there's there's that. There's the custom Mile High Endurance logo core and this is a, a you know on a black background which is kind of cool and you know what they did i was talking to david about this they have a new machine that they're using to make these where they can now take the um, not include the rip laces raised lettering on it which is great because then it doesn't obscure the logo which is cool i mm-hmm. love that and then they've got the skull and crossbone core that uh, has the logo on it. They're actually going to do a black version of that in the um, in the final production for us. And they're sending us a couple more samples. And so that's that. And then what I've got here around the corner, I'm going to actually use Bill's set since I haven't sent it to him yet. Sorry, Bill. All right. Yours is coming. But uh, here here is. I'm going to actually show you a couple of different things. We've got. I've got one, two, three, four different colors of the bungees. So this is, these are the red ones. This is, uh, this is Bill's set. Here's what orange looks like. We actually got a couple of different samples so we can see what they look like against the logo. Orange. We've got blue from a set that I ordered a couple of weeks ago. Um, and that was actually paired with some yellow uh, yellow cores, and these are these are what they call the skinny cores. Uh, I think these are probably the best set for us. And then this is what black looks like. Uh, this is from a set that I've already started uh, using. You can see on here there are. Let me hold that up a little little better. You can see there are five different lengths of bungee ranging from extra large, large, medium, small, and extra small. And the idea here is what you do is you hold, you can see those round dots that are on each of these five segments. The idea is that you basically hold those up to your laces on your shoe. And I've got a, I'm holding up a shoe here so you can kind of see what they look like to find what would be the best size for each of the eyelets. And what I love about these is that you can basically customize each eyelet to be the exact amount of tension or tightness that you want around your foot. So if it's a little tight, no problem. You just put in a slightly larger bungee to make it a little looser. If it's a little too loose, you just basically put in a slightly smaller bungee. And you can see how they connect. I'm going to try to illustrate this. So one of the things that um, that I was trying to figure out when I was first getting this is, well, how do you get the bungee through the lace? Well, if you'll notice at the top of the, uh, actually both ends of the rip laces um, bungee holder, there are these wires. 
that are around that end. You basically pull that little wire off and that is your little thing, your little wire to thread the bungee through the hole. So I'm gonna grab one of these and I'm gonna grab one of these blue bungees from this other set here. And it's simple. All you do is just take that, wrap it around, and now you've got this wire that you can just stick through the eyelet hole, and that pulls the bungee through. And then when you have the bungee through, all you have to do is, I'll just snap this one off so you can see it here. You just basically take that core and then pull the bungee into the, each of the holes on either side of that core and bang, you're done and that's it. So what's really cool about this is one, there are no loose laces. So even if, you ha even if you're not like an elastic, like you're not, a, let's say you're not a triathlete, you're a runner and you have no reason to actually do fast transitions. One of the things that's cool about this is you never have to worry about your laces coming untied. Right, I mean, they just they won't come untied, right? And so you don't have to stop. And it, nothing worse than being in a 5K or a, even a 10K or whatever, any distance race, and having your shoelaces come loose and having to stop in the middle of a race to tie your laces. And the other thing is, if you are a triathlete and you like elastic laces, you have no loose ends. You get nothing flapping around. Um, you've got nothing that can come loose, like the slide lock. I can't remember the name exactly of the brand, but the, the, it's got a slide lock. And that slide lock would always come loose. And you always had these extra pieces of lace that you had to do something with. You had to trim, right? You know, like you had to cut them. Mm -hmm. And then if you cut oh, them, right. yeah. they, remember how they frayed after you cut them? And you maybe would you, yes. I, I would like take a lighter mm -hmm. and melt and the melt end. And melt the end. God, it's like... Come on. <laughs> Process. So, yeah, I think they're zip laces. Is that what they are? I don't know. There's a couple of different ones out there that different. sort of the same thing happens. And it always takes me, I, I have to go to get the YouTube video or something to figure out how to put them all together. <laughs> yeah, right. I don't quite remember it. You know what I mean? It's like, ugh. What? Wait. Anyway. Yeah. Yep. And, uh, yeah. So they're really cool. They're great for traveling, too, by the way. Oh yeah, and you're getting in and out of like uh, security. You're just TSA popping shoes and all off. That. Yeah, yeah. Take, and they're really good for when you're on the airplane and your feet hurt, and you can just take off your shoes with your other foot really easily. That's you awesome. do know why your feet hurt, right? When you get on a plane. I have no idea. Your feet start to actually swell. Oh, when, yeah. when you fly, yeah. That's right. Mm-hmm. Yep, yeah, that's a uh, good reason to wear compression socks. Or comp yes. Comp yeah. So, well, you know, it's interesting. So I'm talking to David from, um, from Rip Laces on this, and I'm, I mentioned to him, I'm like, man, you could almost get away with doing a dress shoe version of this. And he said <laughs> he's actually seen somebody who's actually put them in in the reverse with the core under underneath, underneath where the tongue is and just the lace on top. Uh-huh. And I'm like, that makes a lot of sense. Duh. Wow. And then they're actually looking into stainless steel versions of different finishes um, and that Ooh. sort of thing. Yeah, I mean, this. Like titanium. <laughs> exactly. Or graphite. I, I told this guy, slick. I got to have him on the show. You ought to hear his story. I mean, he was telling me huh. how. They just started this like four years ago, and it, and it was really kind of a side thing. You know, his real deal is like he um, he's uh, a contractor, and he you know remodels houses and that sort of thing. This is just kind of a side thing. He's a he's a CrossFit guy, <laughs> and um, and he talks about somehow getting a connection. They were on a trip in Florida, and they thought as long as they're in Florida, they might uh, might as well try to visit Iron Man, and they had a contact at Iron Man, um, at the Iron Man headquarters office, and they, <laughs> they go into the Tampa office, and he's got his, you know, his Rip Laces t-shirt on, and shorts, and flip-flops, and he's like, and he, was, he t tells his wife, I, I feel like we're trying to sell lemonade at a lemonade you know, like we're like lemonade stand people. And I'm like, holy crap, what have we walked into? What are we doing here? That is funny. So, 
Anyway, I, I just wanted to share those two products this week um, on the YouTube channel, Riplaces. So we've got, we're really getting close here. We don't have the site up yet um, on Riplaces for you to direct order, but we're gonna have two different options in terms of configurations uh, for you to order. And um, I've got a little bit of information here sitting here in an email that I'm gonna uh, make available to you here real quick. I got an email late last night from David. And give me a second here and I'll, I'll get that up. And um, come on, load, load, load. Oh, it's just, uh, just, just me here. Okay, so David. All right, so basically you're gonna get uh, what the, oh yeah, so here we go. Um, the Mile High Endurance Custom Set, black bungees, 12 black skinny cores, two custom print Mile High Endurance cores for $19.98. Uh, they'll provide free shipping. And then you can get two black skulls with the Mile High Endurance logo in addition for $5. Uh, we'll get more samples. And they do not have the site up yet, but the way basically it'll be, you'll go to riplaces.com and then there'll be some forward slash. Um, and uh, you'll put in that URL and it'll take you straight there and you can order them directly. And they'll make a great gift if you're not, uh, if, if uh, maybe you're listening to this and <laughs> you want to get something for somebody who races uh, runner or triathlete or whatnot um, there you go um, so there you go so hope you enjoyed that first video episode here of uh, of product coverage here on mile high endurance and we'll go ahead and end the video